what's up guys it's osiris welcome to a brand new acoustical video in this video we'll be taking a look at the types of sessions we have in acoustica so let's go over to file new and we can create a new recording session so this is a single track type of session where you can edit just one audio file or record one audio track and this is similar to the type of sessions you have in tools like FL Studios, Edison, or Austin Audio. So I'm just going to drag in an audio recording here. And you can only edit this audio recording. So this is a single track audio session. So it's called the recording session. The other kind of session we have here is a new CD project where you can um reap information from your cd and work with that we're not going to be looking at that in this video and the last type of session we have is the multi-track session so you can create a multi-track session in acoustica so i'm just going to name this session one i'm going to leave it at the default and let's click ok so let's overwrite this and we have a multi-track session here so Acoustica gives you a session menu here that you can use to work with a multi-track session. So let's insert a new track and we can insert multiple track or use Ctrl T to do that. I'm just going to import some audio tracks I have here. Let's import this and this imports them into one track, but I'll drag this down to this track. I'll leave this here and drag this down to this track so we can play this. Verify that your proxy connection is successful. So you have three different tracks here and you can process each of them individually in the same session. So that's how you work with different types of sessions in Acoustica. You have a recording type of session and you have a multi-track session. So that'll be all for this video. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you learned something new from this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. If you have any questions about this, leave them in the comments below and I'll see you guys in the next video.